The eruption at the summit of Kilauea Volcano has passed the four-month mark, and the start and stop activity has persisted over the last several weeks. Following a pause that lasted less than one day, the eruption resumed late Wednesday afternoon and remains confined to the summit crater within Hawaii Volcanoes National Park. The active portion of the lava lake has maintained a similar footprint over the last few weeks. Now there is a steep spatter cone in the eastern portion of the crater, which has recently produced vigorous spattering and small lava flows. The location of the spatter cone relative to the main eruptive vent can be seen on this webcam. The U.S. Geological Survey published this reference map on January 28, laying out the current footprint of the ongoing eruption. One eruptive vent is intermittently active along the western edge of the lava lake. When this vent is effusing lava, it pours into the active portion of the lake, colored red on this map. During eruptive pauses, the only active lava is within a pond just north of the vent, colored dark purple on this map. Lava is presently visible from three public overlooks in the National Park. Since the current eruption began on September 29th, scientists say a total lava volume of approximately 45 million cubic meters, or 12 billion gallons, has effused. Earthquake activity in the summit region remains below background levels. The USGS Hawaiian Volcano Observatory says no unusual activity has been noted along Kilauea's East Rift or Southwest Rift zones and there are no indications of the eruption migrating elsewhere on the Hawaii Island Volcano.